Hello and welcome to a guide on how to download and install Dragon Block C or any other mods from Jin Games. Ok, let's start by downloading the mods. Open up your browser and type in the address main.jingames.net. Move your cursor over the menu titled Minecraft and click on All Downloads. Make sure you have 1.7.10 selected at the top. Now scroll down to the bottom of the site to see the download links. To play any of the mods you will need to download the core mods titled JRMC Core and JBRA Client. Click on JRMC Core which brings you to the download page and then click on the download button. If it doesn't work for you, then just click on the bottom with right click and then copy the address of the link. After that paste it in the search bar and press enter. Your browser will most likely ask if you want to keep or discard the file. Just click on keep to continue. Now repeat the same process for JBRA client and also every mod you want to download as well. For example, in this case, it's Dragon Block C. Now we will need to download Minecraft Forge to load the mods. Search for Minecraft Forge, click on files.minecraftforge.net and search for the 1.7.10 version. Click on it and download either the latest or the recommended version installer. Wait for 5 seconds and then click skip at the top right corner. Now we will need to download a Minecraft launcher. I'm just going to download the main launcher from Mojang, but there are a lot of different ones so just pick whichever you like more. Now we are done downloading most of what we need, so let's install our launcher. First, let's log in to our accounts. After logging in, Let's create a new installation and select 1.7.10 as our game version. Once it's done, click on play to start downloading the game. Quit the game and start your Minecraft Forge installer. If you haven't installed Java on your computer, then it will give you this error message. Just click on OK and it will send you to the download site to get Java. Once the download is done, just click on install and wait until it finishes. Then close it and start Minecraft Forge installer again. In the installer, make sure that you have Install Client selected. Here you can also check your default Minecraft folder location. On Windows you can also find your default Minecraft location by clicking on Start and then typing in percentage sign app data and percentage sign and press enter. There you should be able to see a dot Minecraft folder at the top. Enter it and create a folder titled mods. And inside that folder you can also create a folder titled 1.7.10 or any other game version. That way, if you start Forge, it will only load the contents of that folder if you started that specific version. 
copy the mods over into the mods folder or inside the folder with the same version you plan to play with. Start Minecraft again and make sure you have Minecraft Forge selected. This should appear automatically if you have installed Minecraft Forge. And press play. Once it's done loading, create a new world to test if it worked. Yeah, and that's it for this installation guide. A big thanks to all the four supporters and patrons, especially these guys. You guys are just amazing. Thanks for all the love and support, and I hope to see you in the next video.